Music Studios in New York. It's Late Night with Conan O'Brien. Tonight, Mad Lover. Brian Reynolds. And musical guest, Simple Plan. With Matt Weinberg and Matt Weinberg 7. Welcome, welcome, yeah, all right, woo! I love you too, sir. <laughs> Hulk Hogan apparently loves me. I love you. Uh, thank you, thank you. Uh, welcome to the show, that was fantastic. Max, good to see you. I love you too, Con. All right. <laughs> that was creepy. <laughs> yeah. Nothing says rock and roll like a brown suit. Uh, <laughs> I'll rock you out and I'll do your taxes. Uh, <laughs> I'll do it all. We got a great show tonight, yeah, huh? We do. Excellent program. Uh, of course, uh, big news for us anyway. The writer's strike finally over, and I gotta say it's <laughs> yeah. nice. done. Done. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, and I just want to say uh, personally, it's it's great to have them back. Uh, in fact, they wrote that. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first thing they wrote. Say it. Say it. <laughs> Or we'll leave again. Uh, no, it's, it's great. It's great having him here, and uh, we're going to have a lot of fun and much to talk about. Of course, a lot's happened in the last three and a half months uh, of the strike. A lot of stuff has gone on. This interesting fact, while our writers were gone, Democratic candidates Hillary Clinton and Barack Obama both declared their support for the writer's strike. So that was cool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, President Bush announced he's in favor of a reader's strike. <laughs> Like that. I just doesn't like the idea. Oh. Uh, Senator Hillary Clinton, of course, in the news. Senator Hillary Clinton has now lost eight primaries in a row to Barack Obama. Yeah. Eight in a row. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Hillary dismissed Obama's success by saying he's only winning states with a huge African American population like Maine. <laughs> Um, speaking of Hillary, uh, last night, uh, Hillary gave a campaign speech, and she surprised the crowd when she introduced her running mate. This electrified people. No one thought this was going to happen. She introduced her running mate last night. Take a look. Fantastic. Uh... Yeah. Great. No. Yeah. Apparently. Okay. Apparently, she's really going after the tiny Mexican vote. Important. You can't unify the party if you don't have the tiny Mexican vote. Uh, on the Republican side, of course, John McCain's on a roll. He's on a big roll right now. Uh, after John McCain swept yesterday's primaries, he purposely stole a line Barack Obama's been using, I'm fired up and ready to go. Yeah. Yeah, when uh, Obama heard this, he stole a line McCain's been using, I'm old and not sure where I am. <laughs> and have, I guess it was... You all, anyone watch uh, Roger Clemens testify today? Okay. Two of you. Uh, do you know who I am? Uh, earlier today, Roger Clemens testified before Congress about his alleged use of steroids and human growth hormone. Yeah. Yeah, he says he didn't do it. Yeah, but there was an awkward moment when Clemens leaned on the table and it shattered. <laughs> uh, 
Um, <laughs> probably a mistake. Uh, got some celebrity dish. Yesterday, Paris Hilton's brother was arrested for drunk driving. Oh. Paris Hilton's brother, yeah. Yeah, up until now, Paris's brother was uh, only famous for being the one guy who hasn't had sex with Paris Hilton. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Did I mention the writers are back? <laughs> the, uh, the New York Post is reporting that different stroke star Gary Coleman was secretly married last June. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, uh, the ceremony was held in a synagogue so Coleman could use the line, What you talking about, Rabbi? <laughs> No. No. I liked it, and that's enough. <laughs> Please yourself first. That sounded weird. Uh, we, uh, we're a dirty crowd. Uh, this week, I gotta mention this. Uh, a man in Florida was arrested for hitting the manager of a Taco Bell in the face with a bag full of tacos. That's true. In the face, yeah. Afterwards, the Taco Bell manager said, you know, it's weird, my tacos usually don't attack me till I'm in the bathroom. <laughs> we can do it. And we will do it. <laughs> A joke about the diarrhea. All right, everybody. <laughs> we got a... Uh... Excellent show this evening. Excellent show. Uh, big stars are here. Uh, from the Today Show, we're thrilled. Our good friend Matt Lauer is on the program. Yeah, he's a good man. I'll bow to him. He's a professional. Very funny guy, very talented guy. Star of the new film, Definitely Maybe. Ryan Reynolds is on the show. Oh, yeah. Ladies like Ryan Reynolds and fellas. Uh, measle guest tonight, Simple Plan, gonna perform. I'm liking the whole thing. <laughs> and right over here, don't let the suit fool you, Max Weinberg and the Max Weinberg. Hey, Max! Come on in. <laughs>